Well, five weeks now before the start of the Olympics in Rio, police say a mutilated body has washed up on Copacabana Beach, where the beach volleyball competition will be held. This horrific discovery comes as Olympics organizers deal with a raft of problems, including severe pollution in the venues for sailing, rowing, and other water sports. Ben Tracy is there. The brown stuff there, that's yes. all raw sewage? Yes. We flew over Rio with Mario Moscatelli, a biologist who's been documenting the city's vast water pollution problem for the past 20 years. This is just unreal. I mean, this water is black. He hoped the Olympics would force Rio to clean it up. We had seven years and our authorities didn't do almost anything. This is a toilet. Raw sewage still flows from Rio's poor neighborhoods right into the water. It sounds crude, but this is basically like flushing a giant toilet into yes. the ocean. Yes. In the marina where Olympic sailors will launch their boats, we saw a giant plume of sewage streaming into the water. Tests found disease-causing viruses in Rio's waters 1.7 million times the level that would be considered hazardous in the U.S. The problem is not just sewage, it's also trash. Tons of it floating here in the bay, and some athletes say they're worried about running into it. Aranza Gamusio is an Olympic sailor from Chile. Are you worried that the trash might impact the competition? We've seen it in other boats that they've collided with, a, maybe it's a chair, whatever, it can be anything. Oceanographer David Z says the Brazilian government promised to install eight treatment plants on Rio's polluted rivers. They built just one. They promised to treat 80% of the sewage flowing into Guanabara Bay and are only treating about half. So if you had to grade the job the government has done cleaning up the water, what grade would you give them? D. 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 So they haven't done a very good job. No. It's easy to criticize. Guido Gele is with Rio's environmental department. Why has Rio not done what it promised to do? Well, this is an uh, interesting question. The problem is the sewage systems because it's not easy, it's very expensive. And for Olympic Games, there are no problems with the surface of the bay in the place where the games will be. But it's hard to ignore that one of the most beautiful places on Earth might not be ready for its close-up. Ben Tracy, CBS News, Rio de Janeiro.